Insects suck. They also bite and sting. Some inject venom that can kill outright or produce a deadly allergic reaction. Others, like mosquitoes, spread parasites that are responsible for the deaths of hundreds of thousands of people annually. So today, I'm going to tell you about the deadliest insects in the world. 1. Kissing Bug The 130-odd members of the subfamily Triatominae, are also known as kissing bugs, are vampire bugs for their tendency to bite humans, around the soft tissue of the mouth. The insects are found in 28 states in the US. However, the ones here rarely carry Chagas disease, and the cases in the US are thought to have originated in Central America, where it is endemic. Chagas kills about 12,000 people annually worldwide. Victims are typically asymptomatic for 4 to 8 weeks. Even in the chronic phases, most people show few symptoms, but 45% develop heart disease 10 to 30 years after the initial infection, and this can lead to heart failure. 2. CC Fly Native to tropical Africa, these big, biting flies spread the parasitic infection that causes African sleeping sickness, a disease that is 100% fatal without treatment, and the treatment itself is notoriously difficult. There are drugs, but they must be administered with great care, and parasite resistance to them is always a risk. If bitten by an infected CC fly, you develop confusion, poor coordination, numbness, and difficulty sleeping. Then you die, most likely. Because the disease is so fatal, recent mitigation efforts have focused on controlling the bugs themselves, which has reduced the number of cases exponentially. In years past, African sleeping sickness was responsible for killing as many as half a million people every year by some estimates. In 2015, fatal cases were estimated at 3,500. 3. Indian Red Scorpion There are about 1,500 species of scorpions, of which only a few dozen are venomous. The Indian Red is the most lethal of all, in some parts of the world, up to 40% of stung victims succumb. This scorpion is a major problem in India, Sri Lanka, and Nepal, for example, because it is frequently found around human habitations where barefooted children play. Scorpions are shy, nocturnal arachnids but will sting when threatened. Although less than 3 inches long, the India Red packs a potent venom, which results in severe pain, vomiting, sweating, breathlessness, and alternating high and low blood pressure and heart rate. The venom targets the lungs and heart and can cause death from pulmonary edema. Anti-venom has little effect on the bite, although the blood pressure medication parazosin has been shown to reduce the mortality rate to less than 4%. Despite this, the Indian Reds are often kept as pets in India. Maybe because, like most scorpions, they glow under a black light. 4. Deathstalker Scorpion The Deathstalker is another highly venomous scorpion, and is found in scrubland habitats from North Africa through the Middle East and Central Asia. A single bite rarely kills a healthy adult, but it can be fatal for children, who require massive amounts of anti-venom. The Deathstalker's venom is a mix of four potent neurotoxins, that can cause heart failure. In 2010, Air Force Staff Sergeant Monique Monroe Harris was stung by one of these scorpions in Kirkuk, Iraq, and medevac to the airbase at Ballad, then to Germany. Her blood pressure dropped to near zero multiple times on the flight, before she was given anti-venom. Her call sign is now Scorpion Queen. The Deathstalker's venom also has the distinction of being the most expensive liquid in the world, at $39 million per gallon. That's because it's difficult to collect and you get only a tiny drop per scorpion. In fact, it takes about 2.64 million milkings to get a gallon of venom. The other reason it's so expensive is that it has shown promise in treating brain cancer, arthritis, and bone disease. 5. Black Widow Spider What this spider has going for it is a really scary name. Otherwise, you probably wouldn't hear much about it. It rarely kills people and many who are bitten never even know it. There are 32 types of widow spiders, including the western, southern, and northern widows, as well as the red, gray, and brown widows. They're found on every continent except Antarctica. The females are usually dark-colored, frequently with red, white, or brown markings on the dorsal of the abdomen. Some have the classic hourglass-shaped markings, and some do not. Black widows are usually small, but carry an unusually potent venom that contains larotoxin, a neurotoxin that can cause pain, muscle rigidity, vomiting, and sweating. Symptoms typically last three to seven days. Only the female bite is considered dangerous to humans. Each year, about 2,200 people report being bitten by black widows. None has died since 1983. On the other hand, some house cats have died of convulsions or paralysis. 
6. Brazilian Wandering Spider If a Brazilian Wandering Spider happens to wander your way, you'll probably notice, as it has a leg span of up to 7 inches. Found in South America and parts of Central America, it's also known as the banana spider, since it occasionally turns up in shipments of bananas to other countries. These spiders also frequent houses, cars, shoes, boxes, and other places we like. Brazilian wanderers are nocturnal hunters, that hide during the day rather than building a web. They belong to the genus Phonutria, which means, murderous, in Greek. The Guinness Book of World Records routinely names the Brazilian wandering spider as the world's most venomous, and although they rarely kill humans, their bite is especially toxic and can cause severe burning, sweating, and goosebumps followed by high or low blood pressure, nausea, hypothermia, blurred vision, vertigo, and convulsions. 7. Brown Recluse Spider The brown recluse is a small, shy creature that is often found in attics and basements, where it does its best to stay out of the way. Its reputation as a killer is, like the Black Widow's, overblown. Although theoretically lethal, there are, in fact, no documented deaths from the brown recluse. On the other hand, a bite from this spider can really ruin your day. That's because it has necrotic venom, meaning it kills tissue. As a result, an untreated bite can create a gaping bloody hole in your flesh and can lead to amputation. In severe cases, the venom can cause red blood cells to burst. Which is not good, treatment typically involves immobilizing the limb, applying ice, and a tetanus shot. Brown recluse spiders can live for 10 months without food or water, but it probably doesn't improve their mood. They can be identified by the fact that they have three sets of eyes instead of four, unlike most other spiders. But if you're close enough to make that distinction, you're probably too close. 8. Bullet Ants Bullet ants, which live in rainforests from Nicaragua to Paraguay, are so named because their sting is said to feel like being shot by a bullet. It has also been likened to walking over flaming charcoal with a 3-inch rusty nail embedded in your heel. You get waves of burning, throbbing, all-consuming pain that lasts up to 24 hours. The Sater Mawe people of Brazil use bullet ants in their warrior initiation rites. 80 of them are woven into gloves made of leaves. A boy then slips on the gloves. The goal is to keep them on for 5 minutes. Afterward, the boy's hands are temporarily paralyzed due to the ant venom and he may shake uncontrollably for days. Over a period of months or years, the boy must go through this ordeal 20 times to become a warrior. 9. Mosquito The deadliest insect is, in fact, the deadliest critter in the entire animal kingdom. It is the humble mosquito, which kills more than 700,000 people every year. Skeeters are vectors for a host of nasty diseases, including malaria, dengue, West Nile, yellow fever, Zika, chikungunya, and lymphatic filariasis. Malaria is the big one, in 2017, roughly 435,000 people died of the disease worldwide. That's one person every 30 seconds. Mosquitoes have a special organ, the maxillary palp, which detects CO2 released from our breath and guides them to us, where they consume three times their own weight in blood. Mosquitoes are known to prefer beer drinkers, probably because drinking a beer increases the ethanol content in your sweat. Ethanol turns mosquitoes on. Plus, all booze increases your body temperature, which makes you easier for a mosquito to find. People of greater body mass attract more bugs for the same reason. Mosquitoes also prefer people with O-type blood. Nobody knows exactly why, but the assumption is that O-blood type people smell better, to mosquitoes at least, than everybody else. 10. Driver Ants Driver ants belong to a large genus of army ants found mostly in Central and East Africa. They form colonies that may be as large as 20 million ants. Potential trouble comes when their food supplies run short and they form large columns that attack anything in their way. This can be bad if you are immobilized or they march through your home. Larger soldier ants have strong jaws and produce a severely painful bite that leaves two puncture wounds. Removal is challenging because you can pull a soldier ant into two parts with the jaws still remaining in your flesh. So we should be afraid of these little insects, right? They are really scary, but in size it is often very small. If you come across such an insect, run away immediately.